good morning welcome back to the channel hope you guys are having a great day so we have the bagged and boosted s550 right here i'm gonna go ahead and uh, definitely miss this piece right here sound never gets old so you go ahead and look right here as we're driving we have the 10r80 i love the 10r80 it's uh it was a different platform to enjoy however shifting through gears is just way more fun when you're driving a manual uh again i'm not dumb i'm not gonna say oh it's faster hell no obviously these 10r80s just are unstoppable really uh however as far as enjoyment goes definitely want a six speed and with that being said, as you guys go ahead and see by the title of the video, we're on our way to the Ford dealership here in town to actually go ahead and try to get an order in for a dark horse with the Tremec. Uh, that is gonna be the plan right now. We'll go ahead and definitely see how this turns out, especially with markups and all that good stuff. We'll go ahead and see what we can do. And would it be, really be one of my videos if we didn't have a cop right in front of us? <laughs> I'm weak. This time it's not me. I paused the camera for like a second. He took off at the freaking stop sign right there. Sheesh. Yeah, he got him. <laughs> so we just pulled up to Farney Ford here in Selma. We're going to go ahead and uh, check it out right now. Uh, I do know they had three basically to uh, go ahead and order. I know two of them were already taken, so there should be one available. Um, and with the help of Joe from Unleashed Motorsports, as well as working with Farney Ford here, uh, we're going to go ahead and see if we can make this happen. All right, so we're just leaving Farney Ford right now here in Selma. Super, super happy. We're able to put an order in right now. We picked up the last order. Again, a huge shout out to the team here at Farney Ford as well as Joe from Unleashed Motorsports who absolutely made this happen. So just like that, we're in and out. Honestly, the hardest part is obviously getting your name on that list so you can go ahead and actually put the order in. I pretty much spent the last two nights uh, building it out so I knew exactly how I kind of wanted it. And honestly, when you're ordering the Dark Horse Premium, uh, your packages are pretty much uh, set in stone when it comes to how I ordered mine. Um, I went with the Ember Metallic, so with that being said, you can't really change a lot of things that you would usually be able to, just because they already have set packages that include everything else that you would have ultimately chose from. Very, very simple, I'm very happy with the process overall. We were able to uh, get this order locked in, so now we're pretty much gonna end up having to wait till pro probably towards May, June, July side of things. Um, and then that's when we'll have some more information. But with that being said, again, I'm super happy we were able to get this order in. Uh, at this point, I'm not planning on getting rid of the 10 speed or getting rid of the Cobra or Shelby at this point. Uh, who knows where life will take us in the next couple months before we get this dark horse. However, what I'm trying to say is we have the feeling of the manuals. We had a 10R80. We enjoyed all around. All of them are boosted, so we enjoyed all of that. Uh, now we're going to go ahead and actually get into a Tremec six-speed manual, NA, and enjoy that. And who knows, maybe later down the road, boost it. And the whole deal about the EECU being locked, it's not that big of a deal in honesty. They're going to figure it out eventually. Uh, and I'll, I'll enjoy it stock. I ain't going to lie. I will literally enjoy it with some basic things done to it and just enjoy the damn car. I know companies that work closely with Ford, uh, obviously they're gonna have permissions to do stuff, uh, which throwing a Whipple on it, etc., cetera, uh, was definitely gonna be in the plans for the future. So ultimately, we're gonna go ahead and get there when we get there. Uh, that's months away. I'm sure they'll go ahead and figure it out eventually. Like, I didn't even notice this until right now, but that plate is pretty damn faded i ain't gonna lie it's been kind of baking in the sun for uh, some time now since it's been down since we still need to do the clutch um i know we're over here putting an order in for a dark horse but that cobra is still down from that clutch we have literally the clutch we just need a bunch of the rest of the components to uh pretty much finish it off but man i am super super excited right now that we have the cobra we have the bag to boost it s550 right here and we also have the red sport 400 over here and the uh shelby's locked away right now staying out of this weather but 
Super, super happy we were able to secure the package on that dark horse. We'll definitely figure out the rest as time goes on. With that being said, huge shout out again to Farney Ford here in Selma, as well as Joe from Unleashed Motorsports making this happen. Could not have done it without either of them. Again, huge, huge appreciation. I know this is a short video, but I definitely want to let y'all know where we're at and what the plans were and if we were going to go ahead and secure one. And obviously we did. So with that being said, go ahead and subscribe because there is going to be so much more to come and I cannot wait. Oh.